Welcome to Beacon Radio, Liam Pay. Round of applause. Hey, thank you. That was all nice. So um, you're a local lad. You're from around these parts. Let's find out a bit more about you. Whereabouts do you live? Um, Bushbury. Bushbury. And you're on the big time X Factor. We like that. Yeah. So you got to go to Barbados and you're in Mr. Simon Cowell's camp. Yeah. That's right, isn't it? Mm-hmm. How amazing was that? Because it just looked fantastic on the TV. It was an amazing experience. I mean, to meet one of the biggest men on the show. I mean, he, well, he's the biggest man on the show. Biggest really. man on the planet. He's got yeah, a exactly. Bugatti Veyron, for God's sake. Have you seen his cars? <laughs> That's all I go on about. With I, I saw car. his Rolls Royce. Did you? Yeah, the wheels on it. Then. So, <laughs> how are you feeling after the whole X Factor experience? Obviously, like, maybe a little bit gutted. Um, but you're looking forward, right? Yeah, I'm oh, well, I, I'm slightly good to because everyone wanted to get through, really. Yeah. But I'm still going, you know. Still marching along, still doing some. Kids. How did it go down at school? Obviously, you you were on the X Factor one week, and then you come back to little old Bushbury, and you go back to school. How did it all go down? Did everybody just jump around you in the playground? In well, the... it was kind of like a well a big downer on that day. I mean, I just sat there in class, and like, why am I here? You know, Aww. I could be out there doing some singing somewhere, and I'm, I'm sat here, I'll be in Barbados now. Where's the but cameras? Like, um, yeah, I had a lot of lot of encouragement from people a lot of people knew my name that's <laughs> so it, yeah. everybody knew my name really the most popular most boy people in the, in the uh, in the younger years knew my name I have a lot of little girls running around screaming at you and all my mates laughing at me about it tell me you've done some autographs in the playground oh yeah i've done a lot yes. yeah, lots of them <laughs> that's cool uh, so you've been backstage in the x factor you've you've seen there you've been there done that who's your favorite to win your personal favorite who did you make big bonds with or who do you oh. reckon's got the talent to pull it off probably jls so mm. it's on gmtv but at the moment i've kind of like mixed around a bit because like there's loads of good girls um, Owen's got a good chance. Now, I hear you're singing at Himley Hall for us on the mm-hmm. weekend. That's right, isn't it? Yep. Good work. Now, it's a, have you been before to Himley? I haven't, actually, no. You haven't? You I live in Bushman. You've never been to Himley? No. Um, what are you planning to do in the future and stuff? What's coming up for you? Um, you gonna probably do? X Factor next year is probably coming up for me. You're going to do it again? Yeah, I think so. We wish you all the success in the future. Thank you very much. Uh, we hope to see you maybe sign before X Factor next year so you can go <laughs> to Simon Cowell. You can't see that on the radio. Nobody knows what I did. Ladies and gentlemen, Lee and Payne. Thank you.